Hello YouTube, welcome back to the channel. Stack and Perpetrator here. In today's video, we're going to be doing some mail call. And uh, we're going to give a, another shout out to Daniel at Coin Help You. Uh, that is where this came from. Uh, we're also going to do an album fill and a spot fill and an album completion in this video. So get this open it's a thick package for what I for what I ordered Let's see what I can do to get in here Let's see. you can see well padded well protected in a package I was teased before opening a package from Daniels like uh, breaking into Fort Knox you're, uh, you're always uh, never had a problem getting a package from Daniel so to make sure where we need to be cutting <clears throat> Package in a package in a package. All right. Make sure. Yep. Not going to damage anything cutting right there. some of the best packaging there is which is a good thing your coin uh, they care about your coins arriving safely and what we have here is the last coin I need to fill my album and finish off the set we have 1921 and this is the Denver Oop, don't lose it you might loop out in case you in case that didn't show up real good So 21. <coughs> Excuse me. And then let's get a look at the mint mark. There's the Denver right there. So we were, I want to take a I'm going to look for something else on this. Already got my, my little tin uh, archival album set up. I know the you see the 16D spot is empty, but I do have that in a slab. So that is the key date, and then this 21 is. If you don't count varieties, the second hardest coin to find. her in her new home and like I said the 16d here I have in a slab so now I need to get a new uh I need to find an upgrade for my 16s but we are I'm calling this officially complete even though I still have two more slots 
open, but they are unfortunately got everybody filled in. 42 2 over 1 and the 42D 2 over 1. I will probably not be chasing those down and filling these spots unless if I was to get them, I would get them in slabs to verify they are legit. But the only other way that these two slots will get filled is if I happen to get lucky with a jump in find. And, uh, I did manage to uh, do the video showing how to determine the 45 micro S. So I found mine in the junk bin. I was able to set this coin on top of uh, 45 with a regular S to show you the difference. So if you want to learn more about that, uh, check out my video. Yeah. Let me put up, let me post a link to that video down in the description below but I don't most albums little tin is one of the odd ones that actually puts the very slots for they did these two variation slots and then they did this variation slot this one's not so bad because this the micro s is uh, not that hard to run across but I wish they would have left variations out but it is what it is the set is, with the exception of variations, the set is complete. And I will periodically pop back in the book as I find some, some upgrades. Like I said, my 16 S right there is looking a little shabby. But, uh, anyways, thank you, Daniel. Always good to uh, receive a coin from you. And, uh, all of you watching in there, let me know your thoughts down below. Um, what do you think? I'll show you the give you a close up of her in her new uh, new permanent home. My junk, my uh, twenty one. I did. I find I plucked that out of a junk bin at junk bin pricing. That's a hard one to find, but I do like I do like that twenty one D. Anyways, let me know what you think down below, and I will see you on another video.